Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Timmy Treacle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And today I got one movie review for you guys. And uh, this movie is called Powder Blue. And it was released on May 8, 2009. It is a uh, drama film that has a 6.3 out of 10 on IMDb, a 25% on Rotten Tomatoes, and a 72% on Google. Now, this movie was written and directed by Timothy uh, Bull, and it stars Jessica Biel, Ray Liotta, Forrest Whitaker, Patrick Swayze, and Lisa Kudrow. And quick synopsis about this movie is, is on Christmas Eve, you have uh, four complete strangers um, from Los Angeles who uh, one's a mortician, you have an ex-con, uh, a suicidal ex-priest, and a stripper. They're all brought together, like I said, on Christmas Eve by a mixture of circumstances. And with that, we have... Let me introduce you to the characters. You have... Uh, Rose, played by Jessica Biel, who is the stripper. Uh, and she's also lost her dog as well. Uh, Ray Liotta plays Jack. Um, now as he's suffering from uh, debilitating cancer, uh, he's a former hitman looking for his daughter. His daughter being Jessica Biel. We have uh, uh, Charlie, played by Forrest Whitaker, who's an ex-priest and is a suicidal uh, and feels really guilty over the death of his uh, then wife. You have Patrick Swayze playing Velvet uh, Larry, who is a strip club owner. Uh, you have uh, Sally, who is a waitress, played by Lisa Kudrow. Uh, she's a divorced waitress. And with these essential characters, they eventually uh, cross paths with one another. And uh, like I said on Christmas Eve, uh, certain, certain, certain circumstances uh, get them to meet. And uh, this is a wild, crazy movie. Uh, you have, like I said, uh, our stripper, uh, Jessica Beale, who ends up crossing paths with um, a young boy who... Uh, inherited his mortuary business from his father and he's struggling to pay bills and all these different things and uh, he's approached by uh, Charlie the next priest uh, about a proposition I won't tell you what it is uh, and then you have um, uh, Jack who is looking for his uh, daughter uh, ends up finding her being a stripper and, uh, and then unbeknownst to him he actually gets to meet uh, someone special too I'm not going to say who that person is uh, and then we meet uh, uh, Patrick Swayze's character Velvet Larry uh, while he is getting oral from one of the strippers many strippers that he's pretty much paying and then like I said uh, our ex-priest uh, meets uh, uh, Sally at the diner played by Lisa Kudrow and she actually has a crush on him so that's how these characters come, to, come together on Christmas Eve and uh, yeah their lives are, 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 are mixed together uh, in certain circumstances. and I love that about this movie. I love movies like this where they take certain characters and they meet, like I said, under certain circumstances. And I, I just, I love it. I love stories like that. And uh, the way this movie ends is so fitting. But I, I love the way it ended. I, I, just, I love this movie. 
Uh, I wish it was a little more in depth with its characters. I wanted to know more about them. Uh, we got, the, you know, a few things we, we, we got, we needed, you know, but I always want more. I want some more than a background, you know. I want to know why uh, he's an ex-priest. Is it because of the death of his wife? Or is something else happened? You know, I, I want to know more. Uh, and, uh, I don't know, sometimes the, uh, some of the scenes in this movie, I didn't think really were needed, uh, necessarily. But, uh, other than that, I really enjoyed this movie. I there were a few scenes I think that were uh, a little too drawn out, if you will, a little too long. Uh, I think they should they should have clipped some of that. Uh, but other than that, this is a very good film that I highly recommend you watch. <clears throat> this is the last movie that I watched on uh, Amazon Prime today, and uh, you can find it there and watch it yourself. Um, but I'm going to give Powder Blue a 9 out of 10 and two thumbs up. Uh, that's my favorite movie of the day. Um, so now I'll be switching over to uh, Netflix and watching some movies over there. And then this weekend, I'll finally be watching uh, the new Space Jam movie. So look forward to those uh, reviews as well. But in the comment section below, if you've seen this movie... Give me your thoughts and opinions. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. Come on, guys. Help me out. I'm one away from 300. And my goal right now is 1,000. I would love to get there by the end of the year. But I, I don't know if that's realistic. But it would be great. It don't cost you nothing. It's free. And we get to talk about movies. And uh, whether you agree with me or not, it's just a lot of fun. So hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. And if you like this review, hit that like button. But thanks again for watching and check you later.